This is the story of the paper that changed everything in the world of AI. The one that powers ChatGPT, Dali, and the entire new era. Its title, Attention is All You Need. This is the history of AI series. Series where I demystify where this technology came from. This is part 10, the Transformer Revolution. The old heroes, LSTMs, were great, but they had a fatal flaw. They were sequential. To read word number 10, you had to read words one to nine first. You couldn't just run them in parallel on GPUs. It was too slow and this was brutal. In 2017, however, everything changed with the introduction of the paper called Attention is All You Need. It introduced what we call the Transformer. It threw out all of those loops and recurrence completely and it replaced them with one big idea, self-attention. Now, what is self-attention? It's a way for every single word in a sentence to look at every other word, at all at the same time. No more one at a time nonsense. Think of it as an expert consultation at a matchmaking agency. For every word, the model creates a three vectors. The first one is called a query. This is the word's question. I'm a verb, sat, I'm looking for a subject. Next is key or K. This is each other words advertisement. I'm the noun cat. I'm advertising that I'm a subject. And finally, V or value. This is the words actual meaning. I'm cat. Here is my cat info. The network just smashes the query from sat against the key from every other word. It finds the best match, cat, and uses that high score to pull in the value from cat. Now sat knows that cat is the one doing the sitting. And because this is all just magic math, matrix multiplication, it can be done in parallel on GPUs. And this was the breakthrough. It allowed us to scale and scale and scale. And this is why the T in GPT stands for transformer. It's generative pre-trained transformer. It lets GPT-2, GPT-3, and so on. And the entire generative AI boom. And it's not just for text. Diffusion models like DALL-E and stable diffusion use the same power to create images. From a simple party game to models that generate a reality. The story of AI is really just getting started. Thanks so much for watching.